guys it's me Mary Beth and today I'm gonna tell you about how I'm gonna grow my hair out again using B&B super grow <laughs> Y'all know who that is. Don't Joe Clive watching people feed the fish at the park at the gazebo. Okay. This morning I have uh, washed my hair and uh, I didn't have to put a perm on. I just shampooed it and uh, shampooed, put a rinse on, dried it flat. And so now it's dry and flat. And I'm combing it out, and I am going to start from this point. This is, and I said, as I said, June the tenth, and I'm gonna grow it until November, and see if my hair will grow an inch and a half, so that I can get my hair braided to go to either Jamaica or Cozumel for my 70th birthday. Since me and Joe had our 50th wedding anniversary last year and we did a big deal out of that, this year I'm not going to press it to have a 70 party. So what I want to do on my 70th birthday is go back to Cozumel all inclusive. And my kids have agreed to make that happen. So when you go over to one of those islands, uh, listen, you need to wear somebody else's hair because around the water and the humidity and everything, uh, for our hair, it's not going to be good. You will have to wash your hair and if to go out, if you get in the pool, uh, the ocean, to go out every night, you, uh, you have to wash your hair, dry it, and use the curling iron. So... I am going to have my hair grown out enough to have some cornrows, y'all. Believe me, and I'll show you. So, I am going to uh, use this, and I have another video of how I did it last year to grow my hair out for my wedding anniversary, and I used this super grow. Fortunately, my hair will grow, and it, well, it usually grows really, really fast. So after you've washed your hair, what you need to do is just grease, your, part your hair off, and just be sure to get this close to your scalp. And I just part it off, and, and it does. I don't have to part it off in two smaller sections because I don't really want my hair to be greasy, greasy. But that's one thing about this B and B; it don't leave you just slick, you know, slick headed. But it will grow my hair out, and every month from now until November, I will give you an update and let you see how my hair has grown out. I'll let you see the lit now. It has not been cut in the top for maybe a month. So I could easily just right here in the front because I like bangs. I like bangs to come down here. So I will leave this part um, kind of long and then you see it needs to be trimmed. Ordinarily, I would get this part trimmed uh, just straight across. Or I, Look, I said I would get it trimmed. No, ordinarily, I would cut my hair myself right here and make that even. So, I'm not going to do that now. I like my bangs to come out like this and then curl them. Okay, in the back, you see how my hair is? This is starting point. It's been three weeks since I had a fade, and I just love my hair faded in the back. But we're going to grow this out, this right here, 
we're going to grow it out to an inch using this maximum strength super grow conditioner with vitamin E B and B. I kid you not. So let me finish. Just and I grease it. All the way around. Just, just take it like this. And then what I do for my hair, I don't go to the beauty shop. I do my hair, I give my own perms. I have relaxed hair. I look at my other videos. I do my own perms, my own uh, rinse, and all that stuff. I take care of my own hair because I have never uh, had any of my sides or anything broke off because I learned at an early age watching people uh, braiding and 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 uh, going to the beauty shop and getting a uh, weed put in and then look the they get, the hair falls out around the sides and they look like they got a, a Hanukkah on so I have been wearing relaxed hair believe it or not since 1967 when it the first time it came out and no I have not had my hair to fall out because I, I choose to do my own hair. My mother uh, was a beautician years and years ago. Well, they did hair, you know. Uh, in night, she was born in 1930, so the the black women learned how to do hair. And they could do hair for people. But all of them didn't get a chance to go to beauty school. But she did hair. And we learned from her how to do hair. So I think all of my sisters and I, or sometimes I will have my baby sister if I want my hair braided. I can't braid good. I will uh, ask her to braid it. And then uh, my daughter-in-law knows how to braid. And then um, have one lady that, if I can catch her, but she works, uh, that, God, she is so good at, at braiding. I do everything else except for the, the braiding because I don't know how to attach that hair. So, I'm almost done. And it looks like it's been six seven minutes just do it quick and just rub it into the scalp y'all just mu just massage it i'm done um putting the hair grease on and i wanted to you know i just made those big parts so just massage your scalp and get it all over all over like this all right and then today I'm not going anywhere, so I'm going to live. <laughs> I'm going to live with my hair flat all day today. It's dry, and I put my oil on it, the B&B, &B, and then I'm just going to leave it flat like this. And when I go to bed, I'm going to go to bed with it flat like this. And I know most people in our circle... Tie their hair up. I can't. I can't do it. I can't stand it. I have hot flashes. I've never, even if I didn't have hot flashes, been able to sleep with something on my head. So in the morning, however it turns out, will be fine. But I'm gonna give you an update in about a month. That'll be around July the 10th, somewhere in that week that I decide to do my hair, and we'll see how much that it, it has grown out. And 
the most part, we got to watch uh, these sides right here that, uh, uh, you know, I keep cut like a ball fade on the side. Let's see how, if we can get those to where they can pick it up and braid it for my vacation. So, what I need you to do is go down to the bottom and check out my new uh, P.O. box uh, and, and send me a note or something that you want me to try out, something you want me and Joe Clyde to do, something, something special. And I am going to have a post office box video once a month. And I will give you a shout out on my channel. And I have to put these glasses on. I can't see. Um, like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. If you have not subscribed yet, go up there. Touch me in Joe Clyde's face. You can subscribe from there. I made it easy for you. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.